two, three. Parking Day People Way! Here I am on 14th Street, Parking Day, the People Way. And I gotta tell you, I've been doing a lot of Parking Day my whole life. 2006, I was in San Francisco, shot this amazing film that helped really kind of get the Parking Day movement started a little bit better. And then we continued on from there. So I'm excited to be here with this new great event, trying to get people excited about the People Way. Good morning, happy Parking Day. When the L train shuts down, how will you get across town? The best thing we could do here is get rid of 90% of the cars. It would improve life tremendously. I like people's enthusiasm for really changing what the possibilities are. I think personally, taking away space from cars and giving it to the people, uh, just pedestrians, I think is really important in New York. Everyone walks. So Parking Day is an international day where uh, people can reimagine what streets are for and what they can do. Uh, so when the L train shuts down in 2019, volunteers from all over uh, the city and all over Manhattan are advocating for a 14th Street People Way to move uh, the 250,000 riders who otherwise would be taking the L train. Well, something has to be done. There's this huge change in transit. 200,000 people can't get across 14th Street on the subway like they did. But this is also such a fantastic reason to redesign, to look at how the design of the streets work. Well, most people are just learning about the L train shutdown. Uh, there are not a lot of concrete proposals that we're seeing on 14th Street yet. We actually have a winning design right here for what 14th Street could look like with a transit way, including protected bike lanes, wider sidewalks, and M14 select bus improvements to move more people than before. So I went to a Streetopia event, and someone there mentioned the blight of on-street parking. And that really resonated to me. So to me, I, I, more than anything else, I would want to see the elimination of the cars and the parked cars. I don't think it's a good use of public space. If there's a way to encourage more cycling, less cars in the city, it's just, it's just healthier for, for the city and it's healthier for the community. I think it'd be a great benefit to the city. I know I walk around, I see a lot of different bike lanes, um, but I think uh, we need to push for a little bit more. You know, you see cities in Europe um, they're taking it a lot more seriously than us. In terms of this plan, um, it's a great idea because of the L train, obviously, but um, also be because I don't really see this as a as heavily trafficked as a lot of uh, crosstown routes. So we've been talking to thousands of New Yorkers, thousands of folks who live in the immediate neighborhood, thousands of local stakeholders, small businesses. Uh, we've uh, convened a coalition of over 150 small businesses and local civic organizations uh, to support the People Way idea, uh, and we have over 5,000 uh, petition signatures from folks in the immediate area. The clock is ticking, New York. We gotta do something about it. The clock is ticking. You gotta feed the meter. It's the best I got. How much time are you putting in for? Uh, max time, an hour. Now everybody, you want to know how old I am? Yeah! When we, when we first did parking day, there were no such things as meters like this. You just had to put a coin in and you had to turn the dial. And then some old man came out of the sewer with a ticket and said, here's your... No, that's what happened. But 